Hello, my name is Scarlett Jackson, and today I'm going to tell you how to make a sundial, some facts about a sundial, and how it works. Hello, first step is what you need to make a sundial. What you're going to need to make it, it with is a paper plate, well, I need mine, a straw, some tape, scissors, and markers. Oh, not to mention a pencil. Now we're going to talk about assembling our sundial. First, all you need to do is separate the ends of the straw into four. The next thing you need to do is tape it in the middle. Now, this, ne this next part is really simple. All you have to do is draw an end on somewhere on the plate, on the edge. Then, and turn it so the end that aligned with the north. Now, this is how a sundial works. When the sun rises from the east, the light will hit a straw, the straw, and it will cast a shadow on the number. As the sun goes around, it will go to different numbers. And that's how it tells the time. But when the sun sets, your sundial stops working. We don't use sundials anymore today because the sun is in a different position every day of the year. So when the straw, when the sun hits the straw and casts a shadow, Technically, it's not going to work because then it'll be telling the wrong time. So, the conclusion is stick to watches, clocks, digital clocks, because your sundial, don't trust it too much. It is not reliable. Thank you for watching my presentation about how to make a sundial, how it works, and facts.